quiet on set. Recording. In three, two. A representative from Troy University will be on campus Monday, November 17th at 8 a.m. to meet with interested seniors. Juniors with at least a 3.0 GPA are also invited to attend. Please sign up and guidance no later than November 14th. In honor of National French Week, French Honor has hidden Eiffel Towers around the school. The student that has found the most towers by seventh period will win a prize. Please come to room 2C08 with your Eiffel Towers. Today is the last day, so get hunting. Diamond Dolls, please go to the Media Center to pick up your coupon books. A representative from the University of South Alabama will be on campus Wednesday, November 12th at 9 a.m. to meet with interested seniors. Junior, juniors with at least a 3.0 GPA are also invited to attend. Please sign up and guidance no later than Monday, November 10th. Now Bryce is going to provide us with some insight into the world of video editing. Many people think video editing is easy, but that's not always the case. In fact, it takes a bunch of hard work and dedication to complete one video to make it suited for your viewers. In WBGI, we have these things called features. They are the short films like you are watching now. If they are not edited properly, then they will not look so great. Let's take a look at this video that was not edited. I'm gonna fly! Let's take a look at this video that was edited. Clearly, that video was better. Now let's meet some of our Choctaw video editors. Video editing can sometimes be really hard, but when you see the finished product, you're really proud of yourself because it's really fun. Video editing makes me fly! I like video editing because you can show off your cool creations. Video editing definitely improves videos. If you didn't have any video editors like the one behind the camera, videos wouldn't be as good as they are today. A representative from the University of Alabama at Birmingham will be on campus Tuesday, November 18th to meet with interested seniors. Juniors with at least 3.0 GPA are also invited to attend. Please sign up and guidance no later than Monday, November 17th to attend this visit. Wheelits, come to get your fundraiser packets from the Media Center tomorrow. It is mandatory. Senior shirts are now for sale. See Ms. Garland in room 1B27 or after school until November 14th. The cost is $12. Please pay with exact cash or make a check out to Choctaw. Attention all juniors and seniors. The ASFAB will be given Wednesday, November 19th. Sign up and guidance November 13th is the last day you can sign up. Girls basketball and boys soccer are already off a winning season. Go Big Green. The ASFAB presents a great opportunity to juniors and seniors, so let's find out more information about it and when you can take it. The Armed Services Vocational Aptitude Battery is a multiple choice test administered by United States Military Entrance Processing Command used to determine qualification for enlistment in the United States Armed Forces. Here at Choctaw, juniors and seniors have the option of taking this test on November 19, 2014, 7 a.m. to 10.30 a.m. in the cafeteria. To sign up, go to the guidance where you would be offered a study pa packet if they are still available. The deadline for sign up is Thursday, November 13, 2014. Hurry, space is limited. Grayson Ramzaez, I'm part of the ROTC uh, group in Choctaw Hatchie High School. And my feelings on the ABSFAB are the underclassmen should get a little bit of credit, if any, just for taking the ABSFAB and getting a good grade on it, in my opinion. Um, other than that, I feel that it's a great way to get into the military and a great way to go to colleges that you need to go to. I'm Haynes Bridget Drumbetta and I'm part of the ROTC program in Chicago. And um, I think it's a good idea that the juniors and seniors only do the ASVAB because sophomores likely don't really know what they want to do yet for their, um, their future. That's all for today, Choctaw. Till next time. Till next time.